Evening folks, Brian here at Jew Magnetic Earth Watch. Tuesday, December 2nd, 2025. This is a sulfur dioxide report for the Atlantic and the Caribbean. So last Sunday, <clears throat> there's a fairly heavy concentration around the Bahamas. I'm going to come back to this uh, in a few minutes. Now, uh, today, another heavy concentration over the Mid-Atlantic Ridge. This was actually 4 a.m. Mid-Atlantic Ridge. This current time uh, dissipated slightly, but it's still heavy. So let's go... Uh, Take a look at where this started. Uh, a little bit concerning. So this is, folks, right here at the Mid-Atlantic Ridge. There is sulfur dioxide emission from the Mid-Atlantic Ridge. Right from, right from this general area right in here. current time. Also north of the Galapagos, in fact, there was an earthquake here recently, right up in here, same location. So now I'm going to show you something that I found. Just a moment. So April 7, 2024, there was a confirmed steam emission from the Bahamas. This region here, I found it in somebody's uh, camera. I'll include the link for this video, but for now, let's just play it. Again, the Bahamas. So I have a confirmation on these uh, heat detections right here. I do have a camera. It's actually somebody's uh, nest security camera. So again, we have some detections here. Uh, the camera is from uh, Green Turtle Key. I'll take you to uh, Wendy. So this is our camera location right here first. This is it right here, so let's take a look. So Nest, so this is Nest security camera, so this is somebody's personal security camera here. So you can see here in the distance, and I'll show you precisely where this is. This more looks, uh, looks more like a steam emission. So it started about four hours ago. see this. It's three hours ago. And here. see from the color of the emissions, the smoke, that this is not uh, vegetation burning. So let's go back to uh, 
first of all, I'll, uh, I'll show you, confirm the camera location here. New Plymouth. Which is, this road here, turn left. It's right here, in this general area. This is our security camera, it's on this house. Here's the dock that goes out. Here's a little peninsula island. So it's in this direction here. In this direction here, follow me. Pointing out right towards the waters. In line of sight to our heat. Right here. So here's our camera location right here, the dock, peninsula, line of sight, right there. Let me quickly uh, note the timing. Uh, so their local time at 10.20 a.m. Hey, amazing. Keeps them happening at the same time. There you go, folks. There's confirmation that we do have heat signatures and the uh, emission of some sort, probably steam, from this area here. Let's uh, see if we can get a better look on Google. in the waters. Go to windy.com. So windy.com you can uh, use some live webcams and in this uh, case it is uh, let's see uh, right at the top here it says uh, nest. It's the same type of security cameras I have in my house and we obviously have the steam emissions coming out of the waters. again quickly. Dock. Little Island Peninsula. Slightly to the left. There's your dock here. Here. There's your dock. Slightly off to the left. There you go, folks. On the same day on the coast of the Carolinas, the same thing, smoke or steam from the water. I'll include the link for that video as well. So as it relates to the outer core expansion, I'm, I'm sort of expecting this to happen. Sulfur dioxide emission, magmatic in origin, coming out of the uh, mid-Atlantic ridge. Sort of, to me, not a surprise. Just like that major volcanic eruption in Ethiopia, absolutely no surprise. So, uh, unfortunately, on uh, windy.com, I can only go back to uh, midnight or you know, and, and shortly after midnight on the uh, on that data for SO two. So this is why I do screenshots before I go to bed and wake up the next morning and see what's uh, what's been happening. So this is the, uh, we're close to the same time as last year that we had the uh, global spread of sulfur dioxides from unknown sources. Going back to uh, my research on the 3600 year timeline and the uh, last major set of volcanic eruptions, 1627 or 1628, 3,654 years ago uh, from the ice core data and from other evidence 
Santorini, Vesuvius, Mount St. Helens, and Anikchuk in Alaska, simultaneous eruptions, yet only accounted for 42% of the sulfur, sulfur dioxide. I might make a suggestion that some of the remaining 58% came from the ocean ridges, such as I'm showing you right now. All right, folks, that is all.